people. Mass panic erupts at Hades International Airport this week when heavily armed gangs try to seize control, firing at police and soldiers. Now, it's just one of the latest attacks on some key government sites in that country. A Nashville man very familiar with this heartbreak. News 2 Stephanie Langston reports how he's being impacted while trying to help the children there in Haiti. Stephanie. That's right, Mark. Transforming the lives of children in Haiti is Jeff Ponchilia's passion, an effort he's been dedicated to since 2013, supporting multiple schools, an orphanage, and children's hospital, expanding his efforts through his nonprofit, Change the Stars, in 2017. Jeff in Haiti, in just the last couple of weeks, hearing gunfire in the distance and seeing firsthand some of that devastation, saying the attacks are having a ripple effect on a community that was already in need, with gangs controlling the streets, the selling of goods and their ability to work. During all this, it's, you know, the, the children suffer because they're, they're not getting fed. The, the gangs have taken over housing areas, so the families are without home, without a way to get water, without a way to get food, and, and the kids are starving to death. There's more than three million children right now that aren't getting fed enough in Haiti. Now Jeff acquired yet another orphanage in just the last week in the midst of all of this chaos. With more than 60 children living in unimaginable conditions, Jeff was able to deliver their first shipment of food this week. But of course, he's eager to actually be there with the children, many who he says are like his own kids. But then he can't with that main airport being locked down. We'll talk more about his efforts during this unknown time coming up on News 2 at 430. Mark.